Kjotvis men. I need to be careful. This place is heavily guarded. Go, Zulin. Twice if I stay here. Must be careful now. Let's see you, old friend.
Show me what lies ahead. I should be cautious around here. I should not be seen in this area.
What do you see? Clash of iron. There's fighting nearby. No! Uh. Oh. Bag, you old hound. You live. I do. Slipped away in the sword clash. And what of you? Kyotve tried to sell me off. A mistake he will regret. Not today he won't. I saw him board a ship at Aval's Nest not long ago. Sailed east leaving our crew behind. There must still be time to save our men. I will find them. You ready the longship? You glory hound. You would take the rescue for yourself, so the victory song is written about you. I could storm the beach then, slay two dozen men, seize our dragon boat, and hoist the sail in triumph. Up to you. No, no, I will take the beach. A far more dangerous path. You search the longhouse for our crew. Oh, and here. This corpse will not have need of it. Go. I will meet you by the ship.
Stretch your wings, Sunan. Shitless warriors crawl through Arvald's nest like lice. If I use the main gate, I may attract attention. The longhouse. My crew should be inside. be an opening in the roof. will miss your neck. Unpleasant for both of us. If I'm to die, I want to make a mess of it, Bucker out. Unbind me and stick an axe in my hand! I owe you nothing, raven shit. Yours is a clan of thralls and peasants. You! Lay that axe aside or die by mine! You should be on a slave ship to Ireland, Wolfkist! But if you wish to be my first sacrifice... Odin will be more than happy to receive you. You just killed yourself, Erki. Time to die. I will send you to hell herself! <laughs> Kneel, wolf kissed, and I will spare your life. Shut your hole and fight! Die, you sack of shit!
Father, you should have held on to this until the bitter end. If I give my life, will you spare my clan? Let it know! Pick up your axe! Kill them all! No! Find us. What? Oh, yes, of course. Oh. Well thought, Wolf. Many thanks, friend. Even if your wits were somewhat rattled. Listen here. If you can breathe, you can fight. Now come. We take back our ship. You do not need to tell us twice. Thank you. Patience. Strike me. Uh, 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 
What do you see, Sunan?
Show me. Grab your oars. The whale road leads us home. Gods, it's about time. Stop yapping and start rowing. Run up to sail! Rather silent, Eivor. Anything to say for the mess you led us to? We suffered no losses in this fight, and the men who humiliated us are dead. What is that to say? Something like, I was stupid, selfish, reckless, blind, boneheaded, and I smell like blood and shit? I like my version better. Let's put her in here.
To the waves. setting up an outpost on that island. Cured of his men, gnawing at any piece of open land like dogs worrying a bone. Even with you half in the grave, we could easily take them.
More sail! If you suck it back faster than me, you are the victor. How much silver are you willing to part with? <laughs> Fear got you then, deep in your belly. Come on, I need the challenger. Sunin, guide me. You there! You look like you could handle yourself in a fight. Eivor Wolfkist, is that you? Make way for Eivor, the terror of the western shores! Welcome, welcome. Come see what I have. Made with the finest ingredients. You be sure to always bring your stuff to me. These are locally sourced. Have you looked at everything I have for sale? I will see you later, friend. Ja, må være at jeg finner han. Hva er det 
síðasta, minni verkir á deis. Hygga tröllgaldur völu er að síðum duga. Nei, hann sneður til Kristindóms. Hann var ást.
like you could handle yourself in a fight. Eivor Wolfkist, is that you? It is Rolf, yeah? We raided with you that one time up on the northern coast. I am flattered you remember. It was the first time Styrbjorn let us raid so far from home. And Sigurd was sure you took more than your fair share. You're still raiding at your age. We need to grab what we can before Harald has his say across Norway. But I only plan them now. I let others do the heavy work. In fact, I'm looking for someone to lead my crew. I would like to help you out, but I have my own crew now. I did not mean you, but I could use your help choosing a leader. I have picked out a few to be tested. Tested? How? If you want to see someone's true character, test it in battle. <laughs> Show me your picks. My crew is gathered down by the docks. Locals mostly. Even a couple of farmers hungry for excitement. How do they compare to me and Sigurd? There is no comparing. You are building some reputation, Eivor. They are talking about you up and down the coast. Good talk or bad? Depends on who you talk to. Mostly good. Do not worry about the bad. No, they should worry about me. <laughs> my raiding crew Eivor, but they lack in experience they make up for in other areas. Together, we will hammer these lumps of meat into men and women of iron, into raiders. So which from this unlucky lot would lead your crew? See that big brute, Odbjorn? He does not speak much, but he could power a ship by himself. That shield maiden is Ashild the Keen. Her blade is as quick as her wits. And then... There is Thorgils. Rolf! Who is your friend? Keep your head on the fight or someone will crack it. All right! That one is so thick, he could shatter your shield. But the other men like him. And those are the best of the bunch. So, those three, yeah? I've handled more. You want to fight them all at once? Why not? Raids are the stuff of chaos itself. They need a test with no rules. Challenge them, but do not damage them. It was hard enough finding this many. Listen up, you sea slugs. This is Ava Wolfkist, who has killed more men than you will ever meet. Ava Wolfkist? I have heard of you. This will be great. You want to lead my crew? You must fight Ava. 
best fighter wins. No killing, no maiming. Other than that, no rules. Understand? I am ready! <gasps> Fight! A raider needs to be ruthless. better than any man here! You have much to learn. Rolf, your raiders are tougher than they look. Tougher than you know. Thorgils got back up after you went down. He finished the fight. Did you see what you were looking for? Yes. I did not think Thorgils could do it, but he is thick-headed. Like his old man. <laughs> Wait. That is your boy, Tiny Thor. He used to barely reach my belly. He has grown, and now he will want to take everything from me. But such is the way of children. Take some silver for your trouble. And a little extra, for cheating you and Sigurd on that raid. Good luck! Sail out! Yotve will come for us now. Harder and stronger than before. No surprise. Spun on for three generations. I hardly expect him to relent. Your hatred for that man burned bright wolf kissed. I could warm my balls on it. Would you not prefer a pair of sealskin breeches? Just take care, Eivor. Such hatred can make you careless. What he did to your father, he did to all of us. You are not in this fight alone. Sterbjorn will scold you for setting out against his wishes. Of course he will. Is that not something you worry over? I worry only that our king will not see that I'm right. Until it's too late. What about Sigurd? What would he say? If Sigurd were here, he would be sitting beside you, wiping the blood from his axe and smiling into the breeze.
And what will you tell our king about this misadventure? Only the truth. That we attacked Kyotr's fortress, killed his men, and weakened his control of this land. Will you mention the part where you lost your crew and were nearly sold as a thrall? Will that be part of your saga? If there's a skull to dare sing that verse, it will be his last song. returns, and not half dead. <laughs> 